Hello and welcome. My name is Christopher Banish. I am from Stockton, New Jersey, USA. This lesson is for week three of Intro to Music Production provided by Coursera.org. And I will be covering three topics today. And those three topics are how to open up a virtual instrument in your digital audio workstation, quantization, and velocity. Now I use Machine 2, as you can see here, as my digital audio workstation. I have a Machine physical drum pad for beat making, and I use a Yamaha DX21 keyboard that is actually from the 1980s. It's got some sticky keys, but it works pretty good, pretty decently. I'm going to start off the lesson by opening up a virtual instrument for you guys and recording it, and then I'm going to quantize it for the uh, you know to put the notes in their right placement. And then I'm going to show you how to adjust velocity. So let's start by opening up a virtual instrument here. Um, I'm going to come down to sound four. It's the only one. It's a. It's another one that's open for me. Going to the uh, third-party VST plugin here, and then I'm going to open up the VST plugin, and I'm going to import a classic grand piano bright into that slot. Bear with me if the keys get sticky, it's a little frustrating to deal with, but I'm going to try to record something for you. I'm going to use 70 beats per minute just because it's kind of slow. I'm not trying to work with anything too fast right now. And I'm going to record a nice melody for you, and then I'm going to quantize it. So, da da da, here we go. Alright, so that's a basic, easy, nice and sweet melody to work with. Um, now if I zoom in here, you will see that the notes are off, even if it's a little bit, it makes a difference. I could either go like this and just quantize one of them, or I could undo that, and you'll see that right there it goes back. And I could just press shift and quantize on my drum pad, and it will all, all the notes will quantize together, and it will... Be much better. You can see that they're all they're all perfect now. So that's quantization, and that is opening up a virtual instrument in your digital audio workstation. Let's go over to velocity now. Velocity is how hard a key is hit, and that determines how loud or how quiet a um, a note will be played, basically. So we're going to go over here and we're going to adjust the velocity. Now I can either do individual notes like this. You'll see it goes from 0 to 127. 127. <laughs> That's really loud. Um, but we were at 64. I'm not going to go there anyway. Um, I'm going to adjust all of them at the same time just to show you. It's going to be pretty loud just to warn you. Um, here we go. Yeah, that was loud. That hurt my ears. <laughs> um, so that's all the way up to 127, and then you can adjust it even quieter. It depends on what kind of mood you're trying to set. If you're trying to go for something really loud and action-packed, yeah, you might want something really, you know, higher volume. If you want something quieter and more soft pitch, go for something lower, like... So that is opening up a virtual instrument in your digital audio workstation using quantization and messing with velocity to um, go for loud or quiet. This is my first time doing a screen recording with an audio voice recording. I hope you liked it. I also hope that you had a fantastic holiday. Um, I learned a lot in this lesson and I hope you did too. Take care now.